<clears throat> Hello. Today I'm gonna talk about some soaps. Ding. Um, no. I love cleaning myself. I love not smelling bad. Roll intro. A wonderful company called Godai Soaps sent me some of their soaps to try out, um, which is very lovely of them. I was thrilled when I got an email asking if I'd like to try out some soaps. Um, just love soaps. Just love the way they feel. Love the way, mm -hmm. I love them. I love soaps. So I was like, come on down then. We'll do a little, we'll do a little video. Um, so this video is literally me talking about soaps, not cutting soaps, talking about soaps, the new satisfying compilation, just talking about soaps. So Godai very kindly sent me five of their soaps. Um, I know it's really hard to not focus on me, but bloody hell. So this is the little package it came in. It's a bit tatty, a bit torn just because like, just got a bit bumpy in the transit van. I've tried out each and every one of these soaps um, for about a month now I've been trying them. As a visual aid, I've, I've recorded myself each time before I used each soap. Looking back, that's really funny because why did I film myself before using a soap? Why not use it after when I've got, you know, a, a, an impression? Or, you know, once I build, once I built a rapport with the soap. I don't know why I filmed myself before. Bit odd now I think about it, but I don't, I just think maybe I didn't want you to see me with wet hair. Look a bit like a rat. It was really nice to see 100% natural, GMO free, 100% vegan and cruelty free. Like those are my, those ticked all my boxes. I'm gonna go through each and every one of these soaps with a visual aid of me before using it, which is really helpful. These are all the soaps. They are in the theme of the elements. So we've got water, fire, wind, and earth. The first one I used was fire. Um, oh, roll VT. This was me talking about fire. <laughs> Hi, this is my first time using these soaps. Um, I'm gonna review them one by one. So I'm gonna start at the very top. <laughs> And I'm gonna start with the um, the fire soap. So they're all elements of um, nature. And yeah, I'm so excited. I love soap. I just love it. I love the way it feels. I love the, the blockage effect. So I'm gonna go have a shower with the fire soap and I will let you know how it goes. I really like this soap like a lot of them they're very earthy toned it's just amazing i love so i just oh don't you love soap don't you just want to lob it then the next one is the sky um soap i forgot to mention they can be used as shampoo bars as well um because it actually says on the thing so this is the sky one right we'll see how it goes but you know that squeaky clean feeling you just get that instantly i like that as long as i have like a moisturizer to use afterwards um, because it can feel quite stripping sometimes, but it really just gets a job done like And also I'm not in the shower too long when I use these because I just have one job to do Do you know what I mean? Whereas if you have like bottles and bottles of things and you're just constantly like kind of opening them and stuff But this it's quite nice. I quite like having just like an old-fashioned soap It's a lot of fun. And then the next one I used is wind I'm gonna leave it to Vic to take it away with the with the before video. I still can't believe I've done that. I'm not over it. Bef Here's my before impression of using a soap I've never used before. Silly really, isn't it? Go on. Contrary to popular belief, I do shower every day. So that brings us to shower number three. Wind. I really like wind. Um, it wasn't me. Um, I like the the kite illustration on there, signifying wind. Very nice. This whoa, this one smells like um, my kitchen. It's got well, I just read it's got like turmeric in it and like cinnamon and stuff like that. So and like rosemary extract. So it's it's got that very like earthy herby tone tones smell. Um, yeah, it's lovely really nice really fresh the next one i'm going to talk about is the earth one this is the earth soap so 
excited to try. I just love how glossy they feel. I will let you know how it goes. Signing off and signing out. All right, bye. I was just talking about how I think some of them are like natural exfoliants. This one, the Earth one, actually is. It actually says natural exfoliant. So there you go. I was looking at it like it looks like it could exfoliate me and it can. I've just clocked in the the top right it says unscented. I never clocked that before so now I'm going to smell it because I'm... that's confusing. Yeah it's not scented. What are you good for? Last but not least is the water. The water soap. This is the one, I, yeah it's the one I tried most recently. Hopped into the shower with this bad boy. I look like a mess. My ears really hurt. That was the windiest park run I've ever done. I think my ponytail just kept slapping me in the face the whole way around. I'm in desperate need of a shower um, and I'm going out tonight as well so this is going to be a, a serious shower. I'm going to do some exfoliating. Most importantly though I'm going to use the last of my Godai soap. It's the last one in the pack. Um, I think I've been doing a week of using good eye soaps now and um, I'm loving them so far. So this is the last one. This is the water one. So we're at the, the final the final run of all our elements. Renewing hydration made with almond oil, shea butter and cocoa butter. So this, this sounds really like hydrating. Um, very excited. This one's got a lot of a, a more of a like softer smell. Well this one's got almond oil shea butter and cocoa butter in and i remember it's the most like soothing in scent but like soothing in like kind of glosses over your skin it leaves it quite like moisturized not as like stripping as the others feel i think only thing i would say and this is like the tiniest little niggle is that i wish they were um i wish they were rounded ah oh, that's that's really picky though isn't it i don't know it, the only thing is when they're squares like block like like real blocks it's hard to maneuver around your like collarbones and stuff without it kind of jabbing in but that's like that's not i wouldn't i wouldn't change them like i just it's probably because i've only used rounded soaps but no it's not it's not worth changing for that but i just i i don't know i'd rather have a soap that is suppressed in terms of how much smell it emits rather than having a a really strongly smelling soap that has like loads of parabens in you know what i mean i'd rather go with this one that i know is just natural all in all I, I love them. I really do. I really like these soaps. Um, these are going to last me so bloody long. Like, so long. The amount of, like, plastic bottles I'm going to save just having these is just great. Like, I don't know. I'm just very happy that these are in my hands because I will use them well. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you enjoyed the, the, little, the little clips in between and the little... I don't know. I just like talking about soaps. I like using soaps. I like being clean. Um, it's just a fun thing we like to do over here, isn't it? Thanks again to Good Eye. This was a lot of fun. I'll see you around. I'll see you soon. I'm going to go practice my theory. Toot toot, beep beep. Um, see you on the road. See you around, uh, around, around, the, around the web. All right. Thanks a lot. Bye.